Nobody told me it was up. Nobody told me it was up. I, I, I've, I've been on Twitter all morning. I saw nothing. I've seen something else regarding Wisconsin. If you know what happened, then I'm not going to say anything. But nobody told me about this. So we're going to watch it right now. I used to ask myself a lot of questions. Scott, you're at ex-con. How are you an Avenger? That doesn't make sense. But everywhere I go, people tell me the same thing. Thank you, Spider-Man. People still need help, Dad. That's why we made this. It's like a satellite for deep space, but Quana. Wait, wait a minute. You're sending a signal down to the quantum realm. Turn it off. Now. Something I never told you. This place. It isn't what you think. I can get you more. And give you more time. If you help me, so what's it gonna be? Ant Man. <sighs> okay. Um. Turn it off. Yeah, like this, I don't, I don't understand why after all of the stuff that's happened in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, she thought this was a good idea. And then Jan uh, Hope is like, what are you so afraid of? Oh, gee, I don't know. It's not like she's been living in the quantum realm for the last, like, God, how long was she down there? Like, I think 30 years or something. Yeah, no, she's not going to know anything about it at all. It's not like she was able to survive or anything. But... So, like, they're all clearly... Like, not in their suits, but then... When they get down here, he's in his new suit, which I think is pretty cool looking. And then in, like, other shots... Yeah, like this, like all three of them have suits. Also, I love how Janet's becoming more and more, not Janet, Jesus. Hope is like more, is becoming more and more accurate to how she looks in the comics. And there's just Scott. Just being Scott. I, uh, like, I, there's like new devices like in the center of their uniforms. I don't know if that's supposed to help with shrinking and whatnot, but it, it was nice to see Kang in a more cartoony look, like his, his, his how he originally looked. And I, I think it was, there was like a couple shots. Oh yeah, Bill, Bill Murray. We, we all love Bill Murray. Um. Where he's like Yeah, 
Yeah, like where he is like the hologram face or whatever. Um, I don't know. February 17th, that's like eight days before my daughter's supposed to be born. That's scheduling conflict. I really want to go see this. And Hogwarts Legacy is also coming out, out that same month. Um, I think it's the 10th, I believe. Um, I pre-ordered it because I'm a sucker for Harry Potter stuff, but it looks really good. This looks... I don't know. I, I just have a problem with movie trailers these days. Like, they don't really tell you anything about the plot. They just show you, like, the big... Like the money shot to like get you invested emotionally to keep you distracted from like actually thinking about any of it and what it means because like all we know for right right now is they get sucked into the quantum realm and kang's there and obviously he's going to be you know the main conflict but other than that like i we don't know anything about this movie which it's good that sometimes we don't know everything right away and it's better to just wait for the movie like with all the stuff with infinity war they kept everything like super super secret which was good and they showed a couple of like those big shots like with spider-man in the iron spider suit that was cool to see in the trailer but it was like still somehow even better in the movie but I don't know. I love Ant Man. I love like I love Scott Lang. Ant Man, you know, Paul Rudd is just a really funny dude. So charismatic. Ages like fine wine, let me tell you. He's like in his fifties right now, but he looks like he's still in his twenties and stuff. And it's just whatever he's doing, I, I need I need it. Um so Yeah, Quantum Mania. I like the title. Yeah, and I love the use of uh, Goodbye Yellow Brick Road by Elton John. It was a nice touch. Um, so yeah, I guess we'll see how well this movie does. I think it's going to be good. I, I think it's going to be decent at least. It it's going to be decent at least. Um, yeah, I haven't been on like a huge Marvel thing lately kind of like i kind of tuned out after endgame i was just like you know I, I know some people aren't gonna like this but like for me like that would have been the perfect ending to everything because yeah it left some things like it left some loose ends but it also like left those loose ends to your imagination like what really happened you know but um i like i like some of the projects they've they've put out um, I think this one's gonna be a good one. So, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. See you guys in the next video. Probably either gonna be another Apex video, um, or Overwatch. I started Overwatch the other day. So, keep your eyes, keep your eyes peeled.